Welcome to Design Thinking Philadelphia. What is this, you ask? Well, design thinking is a process used to solve complicated problems. It's a set of tools like research, brainstorming, and prototyping that can be used in your classroom or in other ways too. Here's an example of how it works. A group of students decided to use design thinking to tackle the problem of classroom disruptions. Class is often disrupted by noise from cell phones and students are distracted during lessons by playing games or messaging friends. To address this problem, they begin in the empathize stage. The team empathizes with people who experience this problem by stepping into their shoes to understand how frustrating this problem can be. They then learn everything they can about the problem in the define stage. They talk to others to learn what solutions have been tried and why they didn't work. Once they know everything they can, they think of creative ways to solve their problem in the ideate stage. They may think of realistic ideas to limit class distractions like banning cell phones or more creative ideas like a reward system for good cell phone use. They take their favorite ideas and try them out in the prototype stage. In this stage, the design team brings their ideas to life by making versions the users or people who experience this problem can actually interact with. They test these ideas with the users in the test stage where they have people try out these design ideas to see if it works the way they predicted and what changes they should make to their design to make it even better. By using the design thinking process, the design team is able to understand the real needs of the people affected. They know why the problem exists. They are able to consider many different creative solutions. They try their solutions in the real world, and they are able to prove the success of their design. What impact can you have with design thinking?